Good morning. We are so glad you're here. We vlog every single day. So if you like this video, we hope you'll come back tomorrow. And today, we get to see Eve. Yay! And it's sad. But we're taking that to make us less sad about leaving. Yes, because it was a good amount of time. But so quick. Because it's so, so busy. But we're showered. We're going to brunch. We're going to brunch. But we're packed up. We're packed. Almost done. Um, we're going to leave here in a little bit to go to brunch and then leave straight from brunch to, to the, the airport. airport. First stop of the morning, returning tuxedos. brunch. We're just popping in because we have to get to the airport, um, but it's called Testa Vara. This place is so cute. The first people came to give me 25 of us. Oh my gosh, I got awesome I, 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 I it. it. But the rest of the menu so looked even better. Oh my goodness. We were so in a tizzy of rushing to leave. We didn't even show everybody. But we are on our way to the airport. Peter's gotta take us there and quick so that yeah. we can drop off our rental car. Did I hold it together? You did a good job. Yeah. I almost I lost it there at the end. But I did, I but I, I pulled it in. Yeah. I hate goodbyes. Yeah, they're worse, but we're lucky that we were able to come. By the time we get inside, it'll be 15. Maybe they'll be kind to us. Wow, wow, wow. Photo finished, kind of. Seriously. We literally just got through security, and I think they're starting the boarding process right now yeah. for our flight. Very, very close, but literally, we had a little pick up with the gate, or not the gate, the on-ramp for the highway that we had to get on that took us farther away. Um, but everything else went as smoothly as it yeah. could. And Check if it hadn't, happened. we would have missed our flight. Check-in and security were super easy and our gate's right by security. Yeah, um, yeah, like I really think it was worth seeing everybody this morning. It totally though. was. Um, but if anything else went wrong, yeah, we'd be changing our flights. We were a little nervous today. But we did it. <laughs> Sarah's been nervous about the brunch like, all weekend, but we did it. We got to see them, we got to hug them, we got to kiss them. Sarah doesn't feel good, but we're on the plane, in our seats, I'm, like, ready to go. Sick and Josh, Josh Buck is going to pick us up. You'll feel better once we get back to Florida and the allergies go away. And Evie. And she fixes everything. Two hours later. Back in Orlando. We are. And it feels like Florida. Back it up, 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 back it up. We're home. Heidi, are you excited to be back? She's also excited. Because Sarah's not feeling good, so I needed to get her some food and some pop and some salt. And so last minute we found a Wendy's and we're like, well, at least let's get some large Cokes there. Then on the menu, they limited them offer of a black bean burger. So we got that with no ranch and no cheese. So let's, let's dive in. So this is how the patty looks, the typical Wendy's ah! square patty. Peter just went outside to go get stuff, so she's losing her mind. But it's oh. mostly made of rice and corn and peppers and ah! totally vegan without the different sauces. It's been a long, a long couple days for Eve, I'm sure. She's quite, quite zonked. And it's, what time is it, 9 o'clock? And we are officially starting to edit the vlog. And it's like supposed to be special because it's a Alright, since it's getting late and so it's just getting the editing going, we have a big day tomorrow and she was struggling a little bit. And we have been sad with tomorrow's. Tomorrow's our test. Tomorrow's our test. And I, Uber eated some Jeremiah's Italian ice. Mm. 
super, super delicious. Yeah, I was like, where did you get this? Because you, you just went outside with me. And I was like, that was really fast. He said you got it from the, like, I was like, where'd you get it? He said the door. I was so confused. Coconut and lemon. Alrighty, 95% processed. 11.35 at night. It's gonna get up before, before midnight. midnight. Even You're so ready for bed. You're so cutie. You're fine. Bucket list. It's just well, it was posted two hours ago, so they went up late too. Wait. Wow. Everybody's late today. Do you remember the things you were worrying about a year ago? How did they work out? Didn't you waste a lot of fruitless energy on account of most of them? Didn't most of them turn out all right after all? Dale Carnegie. I think Eve is officially a grown up because I have not worn these slippers in years. And I was finally able to wear them today without her like pulling on the bow or trying to get them off my feet. It's kind of nice, but kind of sad too. All right. <sighs> Let's Sarah did say the end. I did do the editing. I did do the editing. It's midnight. It went up before midnight, so we're fine. Um, we don't want to say our favorite parts of this weekend. My one, let's go back and forth. Um, meeting Eli, Dams, mm -hmm. and Victoria's nephew. Um, just being part of their super special day. Yeah. Dom and Vic both, you know, have come into our lives and are super important to us. Mm -hmm. And we're honored to be part of it. Yeah. It was really cool to be a part of Victoria's special moments, like seeing her dad for the first time in her dress. I thought that was really sweet. And just like, We've we had so much time with Dom, but but Victoria means so much to us, and so me being able to like spend so much of her wedding day was really cool, and like just made me value that friendship so much more. Yeah, I think. Uh, and dancing. Oh yeah, I think the other thing, one of my favorite parts was the fact that like we've known Dom for over eight years now, Vic for three, and we've never lived by each other besides the Disney concert program. So for five months of our eight year three and eight year relationship that's nothing mm -hmm. but we have such strong relationship with them but we also know they've got such strong relationship with all their friends in detroit yeah and we hear the names we hear the stories we hear what's going on but we've never met almost any of them yeah so to finally get to meet them and hang out and spend time with them and yeah. see who the other important people in our important people's lives are was was really cool yeah and i think that they appreciated that about us too like mm -hmm. they realized like we weren't just some friends from some disney fanatics <laughs> you know like that are obsessed about the yeah, same stuff i think that they saw that side too and it was cool to just like love them all weekend long and now this trip was the last bit of hecticness We've known for a while, I don't think we've said the date. I think if you've been following along with this, especially the last IVF round, you know that it's coming up. But we've known that tomorrow at 9 a.m. was our blood our test. Our beta test for this frozen yes. embryo transfer. So, so we, it was good timing with the move. And I know it's been kind of crazy with the vlog and like you guys have seen how busy we've been. But that busyness has saved us. Yes. Because last time, we, the first time we did IVF, the, the, that two week waiting period, was eating away at us yeah. and this time we've been so busy that it's flown by yeah, it finally hit me yesterday at the wedding because it was like holy smokes now that the wedding is over that means there's we nothing else yeah and so this will actually i don't know if this will go up before or after we even know um but tomorrow is the day tomorrow's the day we you find feel out good. You feel, you feel good, good. You feel good but yeah and you know, here and, and here. here and here but and we're strong Definitely. yeah and not our first rodeo so no. we know what to expect and we're going to be doing it hand in hand i'm not going to work even though it's monday i'm not going to work i took the whole day yeah, off that'll be nice and we're going to rock it yep it's, it's good, good to be, be home. home we know what our goals are we know what we hope to accomplish and believe me it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at walt disney productions <laughs>